Susie Milano down here with Jason Brown. So yesterday, kind of a tough game for you guys. Had a bunch of changes in the lineup. Were you kind of pleased with how the team worked together yesterday? I think so. We, yes, we were. We had a, you know, we have guys that can play different positions and uh, do different things. And so yesterday was a day that, yeah, we had some guys in some different spots. Uh, Mark and Sini had a day off to begin with. Then he came into the game and got got hit in the knee. But um, yeah, with Betsy over at first and uh, Kramer at, at, at third, and you know, we we have guys that can do that. And so. Uh, with this stretch of games that we have that we're in the middle of now but have in front of us um i think we're going to be doing that a little bit you know giving guys days off and uh kind of mixing it up a little bit you got an outstanding performance by greg allen out there on the bases he's really aggressive 11 stolen bases in the season so far three of which were last night is that kind of a good thing for the team to have that kind of aggressiveness absolutely yes uh greg you know he's been doing a great job of getting on base he's really swinging the bat well and getting on base and when he gets out there really creating havoc for the pitcher, for the defense. I think it really has taken the other team uh, out of what they want to do. It's taken the pitcher out of focusing on making on, on, on making pitches and getting after the hitter. He, uh, yeah, he just, it, it's, it changes the game when he's out there on base because they have to adjust to try to control him, keep him at the base he's at. And uh, he's done a great job, like I said, not only getting on, but then after he gets out there, running, making things happen, and uh, generating runs for us. He's quickly becoming one of the favorites on the team for the fans out there. <laughs> okay, we also saw Fulmer taking some BP today. Yeah. Is he going to be back soon? I hope so. Yeah, yeah I, I hope so. He's, uh, he's really been on the fast track for the type of angle, ankle injury that he had um, ahead of schedule coming back, and so that's a good thing, good thing for us. Again, he's... He is one of those guys that can uh, play different positions and he uh, swings a bat and uh, will be a good addition when he does get back 100% and uh, is back in there for us. We also saw that Fish isn't in the lineup today for the first time all season. Is it just a day off? Is he healthy? He's healthy, yeah, and, and it is. It's just a day off. Uh, Slay balls in left field for us today and it just, you know, because we have guys that can do that. We're able to spell uh, guys when we think they need it. Um, again, in this stretch of games that we have because of the rainouts, uh, it's important to do that and kind of keep guys fresh for the middle of the season and then the end. Um, so, yeah, to be able to give them a day off and, and get some other guys out there that uh, step in and do the job, it's, it's a nice luxury to have for us. All right, and finally, we're seeing Wareham again with the same pitching matchup. We got Pointer versus Simpson. We're going to use that to our benefit. I hope so. <laughs> yeah, well, it worked out well for us last time. And with uh, Bobby Pointer out there for us, we have all the confidence in the world that he is going to continue to do what he's done so far. Um, and uh, it should be exciting. But, uh, yeah, I think the more information that you get, you know, as a hitter, you like to say the more times you face a pitcher, the more it benefits you. Those pitchers, though, on the other side of it, they say the same thing. The more uh, they face the same hitters and, and kind of learn them, that, that gives them more information. If they're able to execute pitches, uh, you know, they like to think advantage them. We'll see how it turns out. It, it, it'll be exciting. All right. Thank you so much. Good luck. Yeah. Thank you, Susie. Susie Milano, send it back to you for more Firebird pregame.